Hello, I'm Joanne Turner reporting from Mobile World Congress in Barcelona and I'm with Stefano Paleri from Iteltel. Stefano, welcome. So you're back at Mobile World Congress this year with a bigger than ever booth and perhaps you can start by telling us some sort of company updates, key messages that you're communicating here this week. Good morning. Uh, yes, three messages mainly. Uh, the first one is that, that um, we are following the uh, trend of industry with our innovation in uh, virtualization and uh, automation of uh, networks. Virtualization means the needs to transform uh, a traditional network to in data center network, network functional virtualization. All the network elements uh, are becoming software to run in uh, centralized or distributed uh, data center and the networks are changing now. Um, beside there is uh, the concept of uh, automation. Um, you know that the margins uh, in our industry are a little bit tough uh, to be reached and uh, this means that the operation of the networks uh, have to be very lean and uh, um, a very, a very um, low cost. This means that we have to automate the operation, to automatize the operation, uh, thanks to the software-defined networking uh, with uh, software modules that can control uh, broader uh, part of the networks and avoid the human touch in the networks. This is the first, just the first, uh, the first innovation and. Uh, in this direction, we are proposing here in uh, um, Mobile World Congress our virtualized uh, and cloud-ready session border controller for network interconnection and the cloud-ready um, uh, communication system for business customers. The second important trend is uh, Internet of Things. All the boots in uh, the FIRA are Internet of Things uh, full uh, of innovation and technologies. Uh, it is true, um, from one side the evolution of towards 5G in the networks and on the other side the evolution of smart objects, sensors, smart objects like smart cars, things and so on, uh, have to be connected and can be connected. So Internet of Things uh, industry is ready and uh, will uh, uh, tremendously grow in the next years. Um, we developed our uh, IoT platform to collect data from sensors and to um, organize uh, those data, opening the interface uh, for third parties application. And finally, the third important innovation is in the field of uh, analytics and the big data. Why? Because uh, now we have available uh, tons of data it seems that uh, can be considered too many. So again, software have to be helpful to uh, help to extract gold from data. And this is important and we applied this principle uh, to uh, help a network uh, telecom operator for uh, reducing uh, the, um, uh, the charm of their customers. Uh, taking advantage of more than 100 kind of data, we try to help salespersons, marketing department, and also the, the CIO of the company to focus campaign to reduce the churn and avoid the churn in for mobile operator that is very important. Okay, so also within that you are seeing a change in the service providers and how their business models are changing. Um, how are you reacting to that within Iteltel? We could recognize the need to, uh, to be 
very innovative but very efficient. No? So very efficient means, uh, I told before, uh, virtualize and uh, reduce the complexity of the networks. Um, virtualization means to run a network, to have a network based on standard hardware. It's very important, no? So we are very close to our customers in uh, reaching this target. But the other, in, the, in the other way, we would like to help telecom operators in uh, uh, simplifying the traditional network. Especially big networks uh, are based on uh, many layers that came from many generations of technologies. Uh, many years ago in transmission we had SDH, in the big network SDH is still on the network since uh, 20, 25, even 30 years uh, before. In the, uh, in the telecom network we have uh, today the old switching technologies in fixed mainly but also in the mobile and uh, uh, now uh, it's needed to accelerate the decommissioning of those old technologies in the modern network. Network decommissioning projects, uh, network simplification projects uh, are very important and to do this project successfully we need project management and it's okay but also important uh, dedicated uh, software tools uh, to help uh, those uh, transformation and simplification of the network. Um, to do this, uh, we, think, we think to be, as it'll tell, uh, ideal partners uh, because we have strong technology capabilities and also strong software capability in, in order to uh, develop uh, tools uh, that are not standard, no? are customized case by case uh, depending on network architecture, network structure and the network evolution. Okay, and maybe sort of more of a viewpoint from you on um, one of the key topics that is also here this week is digital transformation, particularly as everything is becoming more connected and IoT is um, emerged. Um, perhaps you can give us your viewpoint on trans digital transformation, how ITELTEL will play a part in that. Digital transformation is the new things in the industry because it has to be applied not only in our industry naturally but in particular in many many different industries like manufacturing, agriculture, uh, services naturally but also uh, healthcare, uh, government uh, energy, but uh, all the industry, all the industry will be deeply transformed because of digitalization. So it is a, a good opportunity. In particular, I would like to highlight uh, one particular point: manufacturing. No, manufacturing 4.0 is the idea that means the fourth uh, industrial revolution will be the full automatization and the full connectivity among a plants, among the offices of the industry, among the suppliers, among the customers, all have to be connected. For my country, Italy, is very important because my country is the second producer in manufacturing uh, of uh, Europe uh, after Germany and now uh, I think that we need a plan, this plan will last 15 years uh, in digitalization, full digitalization of our manufacturing industry. I think that is, uh, the, it is a good opportunity. Stefano, thanks for your time today. Thank you very much. Bye.